Welcome. This is the Global Summit House Podcast. Catch power interviews and discussions with influential, inspiring, and powerful people. Explore what's possible by tuning into this podcast with our all-new The Writer's Project episodes, featuring one of the world's most inspired thinkers and writers. Visit our website at www.globalsummithouse.com. Welcome back to the show. I have an author today. Yes, yay! It's been a minute since we've had authors. We've had so many different people, and I love authors. I love books. So we're going to go mm. ahead and have Nguyen on the show today. Welcome to the show, Nguyen. Thank you. Ah, oh, thank you. So tell me about yourself. Oh, yeah. I uh, was from Vietnam, mm -hmm. and uh, we uh, have a scholarship to go to Australia to study engineering. Mm. In 19, 1962, wow. and nine, of us, nine of us got scholarship to go to Australia. We thought uh, well, our country is poorer than Australia, so we are not mm. as uh, advanced as Australia. So we mm -hmm. went there and we thought that, uh, you know, we study and then we have time to go sport and swimming and things like that. Mm -hmm. But as soon as we arrived, we we'll get into first year university, mm -hmm. we got into trouble. Study mm -hmm. stress, study stress. Oh, man. Yeah, the language, uh, English language in Australia is different from what we learn in Vietnam. Mm -hmm. So we couldn't understand the lecturer very well. Mm -hmm. And so our head is just worried. Oh. And so we went to the medical center at the university and said, what can we fix this on me? They say, you take the pills, or you take, um, uh, you know, the, the uh, ECT, electroconvulsive therapy. They, they shock you to get Ooh. rid of your, your study stress, or you can do yoga. Okay. So we didn't want to take the pill because of side effect. <laughs> and uh, one of us uh, volunteered to do ECT, and he got side effect and he failed the exams and the regulation is that if you fail, we have to send, be sent home. So we went home. We mm. remain behind. So all the rest of, of us, uh, six girls and two boys, they turned to me and asked me, say, no, now we have to go and do yoga. So we went in there and they asked us to sit down, quieten your mind, one hour, two hours, three hours, our head is still roaming around, it doesn't quieten. So, so we said, well, this is no good. We can't get it to our study stress. So they then point to me, say, you have, you have to study yoga, meditation, yoga, and you tell us what to do to, 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 to stop the, our brain from roaming around. So I <laughs> went to all libraries, all bookshops, and buy all the uh, yoga books and trying to practice yoga and meditation and see what, how to mind, make the mind Quieten down. Oh, wow. And, and uh, I tried uh, meditation for one mm -hmm. week. Mm -hmm. And I thought, that, well, this, this is no good. If you go there and sit there and do nothing, the head will keep on roaming. So <laughs> I then invented four types of breaths. One wow. is uh, modify normal breath, six mm -hmm. seconds long. Normally, mm -hmm. we only have a few seconds, six seconds mm -hmm. long. Oxygen breath, because in our body there's oxygen to feed, to keep our life. And then mm -hmm. quantum breath, if there's the electrons in the body, it mm. run, run the, the, the nerves, and that's the, the, the sort of intelligent part of the body. Mm. So I, I, I thought of uh, quantum breath. And then um, the, the last one is uh, resonant breath. Mm. Now, resonant breath, so you breathe in say, oxygen seven, six, seven, uh, seven times, and then you hold the breath for seven times, or 14 times, or 21 times, and mm -hmm. breathe out again. By doing that, you control the mind, and mm -hmm. the mind has to follow you rather than it follow itself. Wow. And wow. After, one week, after one week, I got better. So I oh. told my mate my, that you practice the way I tell you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you don't, don't practice the way the university tell you to do. 
and they all get better <laughs> and they all get good exam good result and wow. then uh, we go on to to uh, you know to get our degree and go home mm -hmm. to help our country or in mm -hmm. my case because the war went out too long there so mm -hmm. i couldn't get home so i get a job in australia and i became a professor mm -hmm. and uh, i the, the, some of them that just anyone they clear their study stress they don't do yoga anymore but no i keep on doing it from since then until now for 60 years wow and, and after i retired i say i better write a book on this one to pass on what i found to other mm -hmm. people it was very helpful it doesn't mm -hmm. cost any money only 20 minutes 30 minutes a day mm -hmm. and all the exercise yoga exercise i do was very gentle Mm -hmm. I had to exercise every muscle in the body, mm. every muscle, and I use a breathing to control the mind. There's a mm -hmm. conscious mind and there's subconscious mind. Conscious mind knows all about the logic in the body and so on and so forth. The mm -hmm. subconscious mind is sitting there and waiting for your 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 thoughts, mm -hmm. waiting for what you want to do. Like a student, if we have an exam or have an exercise to do, he thought about it. And mm -hmm. the subconscious mind will provide the answer. Mm -hmm. That's what I thought. But it did. <laughs> when nice. I have a difficult mathematic problem, mm -hmm. I said, oh, how do I solve this thing? How do I solve this? I thought it's meditation. And a couple of hours later, the answer came out. I didn't have to. <laughs> wow. <laughs> and uh, all the other guy does the same thing. So they have plenty of time for sport, for swimming and things like that, as well mm -hmm. as study. So they did very well in the exams, and I, you know, I, I practiced for 60 years. So now wow. I, my hair is still black. Yeah. I'm 76, so I'm too ahead. My, yeah, my osteoporosis is good, I and mean, my bone structure is as strong as 25 years old man. Hey, mm -hmm. and I, I don't that. have I, I don't have diabetes. I, Mm -hmm. I do the more yoga to control diabetes. I don't have to take the pills. That was mm -hmm. a the side effect and thing like that. Mm -hmm. And so well, I, I, I wrote a book with, uh, with the hope that people take it up and practice the same thing as me and become young and healthy and uh, live a good life. Mm -hmm. Well, that's amazing. That's amazing. Mm -hmm. Now, okay, Nguyen, right? Nguyen? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no win. Um, is there like a way to do like a really quick way like to kind of guide me through maybe one of the shorter versions of the breathing techniques? Yes, uh, the, the modify normal breath. Mm -hmm. You're breathing for three seconds. Uh, well, why why it, uh, the breath is slow down? Because okay. of our brain. Brain waves, they are the, the brain wave that we know. Mm -hmm. uh, it's uh, the, and the brain wave we don't know. Okay. We, we we are not allowed to. We we can't can't see it. The mm -hmm. brain wave. So there are five of them. Right. Three of them are the one we don't know. That the alpha alpha mm -hmm. brain wave six seconds, and theta okay. brain wave seven seconds, and delta brain wave eight seconds. Mm. Now, if you breathe too fast, this brain wave couldn't follow. But the mm. brain waves are the brain and the intelligence of the body. So if you breathe at six, seven, eight seconds, then the brain wave follows. Say, what is this Mr. Nguyen is doing? He's trying to, to ask me to do something here. And then, uh, of course, our thought come in and say, I want to have a solution of this mathematic problem or solution of this chemical problem and so on. So that brain wave say, ah, I'll give you the answer. And you get the answer and you get a good, good mark in your exam. Mm. So, uh, modify normal breath is six seconds, uh, six mm -hmm. seconds, because of the seven, because of the eight, because of the three brain waves there. The other one is, uh, um, the, there are two other brain waves, they are faster, and we know about it. it, the, it, it the brain wave, the frequency movements, you can feel that. Anyway, so if, if that breath, we do the yoga exercise, you don't have to be very fast, but the, Okay. And so low impact yoga, and okay. then you breathe at six second. Then three in, three out, 
green so you have and I got it. next one next one oxygen breath seven mm -hmm. seconds do seven breathe in seven seconds oh okay so that's seven and then breathe out seven seven yeah Wow. Yeah, because my mind doesn't have anything else to do except to focus on the breathing. <laughs> yeah, that's right. That's uh, well, you controlling it. Uh huh. And then yes. the, the next one, raisin and oxygen breath. You okay. hold the breath at least seven seconds, 14 mm -hmm. seconds. So you go in seven? You go yeah, in seven, seven, you hold the seven? seven? Yeah, all seven because the brain, brain, uh, brain waves are. Mm -hmm. Six to eight, so seven is right in the middle. Of the brain okay. Waves. So you see, it's resonant and breath. I say seven, whole seven, ah, oh, seven. That is a resonant breath. And then, and start again. Yeah. Nice. I like that. That really calmed yeah. me down because my brain is just all over the place most of the time. Yeah. How you connect to me every day, and I, I, I teach you. <laughs> Oh, not very long. And the quantum breath, see, mm -hmm. all the yoga people, they never thought of quantum breath, uh, the, the, the electrons, the electronic mm -hmm. in the body. So mm -hmm. That one creates all the intelligence and everything. And also remove all the pains. And if you mm -hmm. want something, it can, can do that for you. And I did a simulation. The, uh, the thing is electronic, moving in the body. So it is influenced by the Earth's magnetic field. Mm. So you have to, when you meditate, you sit or you lie down, mm -hmm. pointing to the north. Now you you do yoga? No, not always. Not I do the yoga. Stretches, the yoga but yeah, yeah no. in the yoga they have a, they have a thing called a Kundalini. Mm -hmm. okay. They uh, they they stop their breath for three hours. Mm. And that means wow. they, they die, they would have died. <laughs> mm -hmm. Because if we fall into the lake for seven minutes, uh, seven seconds, and we seconds. die. Yeah. Seconds, yeah. And, uh, and so they wow. hold their breath. And uh, the, AB, the BBC put one of these Indian yoga in the coffin sealed up, and he stayed in there for three hours, didn't die. <laughs> Wow. He, he, he saved up the oxygen in the cells, and when he doesn't have breath, he releases oxygen that way. So that's why he didn't die, according to the explanation. Wow. Anyway. Well, no, I do boxing and kickboxing and karate. Mm -hmm. So I'm more of a, uh -huh. a hard, hard girl, but uh, I do. Um, you too. I do Pacwa. Pacwa mm -hmm. is breathing. Um, mm. So I do Pakwa, but I don't, mm. I don't do yoga too much, mostly mm. for the stretching. But I think this is very interesting because I'm trying to do the meditation where I can actually calm myself down. I got a lot on my plate, so this mm. would be amazing. So how can people get your book? Where can they go? Uh, it's at Amazon. Mm. Available, uh, your print, uh, print demand at Amazon. And, also okay. the, the and what's the name of the book? Uh, mind control through breath regulation. Awesome. Mm. Awesome. Well, Nguyen, I want to thank you so much for being on the show. And man, I tell you, if you guys just go back and watch this video all the time, at least you'll get like the three second and the seven second, and then you just go and get the book and then you get all of it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. You know, mm. You're so smart. Thank you so much for being on the show. If someone wanted to do yoga, what do you suggest they do to start? Uh, I got a program on uh, yoga trail in uh, a company, a big company, there are thousands, millions of people in there. Mm. So you can go in there and look me up, and I got all the information put out on there. And also, when you can join my class in there. Oh, and nice. <laughs> I awesome. run classes with people, and they um, they wrote very good uh, good review for me up there. But uh, the other one, you can hire me privately, one on one, group. Yeah. Nice, nice. Yeah. Then, well, uh, by, by that you can have uh, you know personal one on one, and uh -huh. uh, yeah, with a couple of weeks, where you know what to do, and you go on, or you want to do on say 
a month, or two months, or three months, or six months. Some people want to stay on the, the senior. I got Vietnamese senior. Mm. When they get to 60, they lose their balance. Mm. And I train them in yoga to uh, breathe their meditation to get back the balance and get mm -hmm. back the muscles and get back the memories and get mm. back the, 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 the um, emotion. And, uh, you know, they, they get the control of their mind. So they doing well. Mm. Yeah. And wow. the students, students I, um, I, I, I train them in uh, the university in Melbourne here, asked me to go and train the postgraduate students to do PhD. Mm -hmm. And they came and said, oh, so how do you uh, do this thing? I, I haven't done it before. I said, well, you, you know, uh, think about it, do yoga, and the answer will come back to you. And they did mm -hmm. well. They, they control themselves, they do the thing, and the results coming out by themselves. And they're very, mm -hmm. I'm very proud of them. Wow. 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 Well, I want to thank you again so much for being on the show. You guys, all of his information is in the description box below the interview. So all you have to do is just click on the link. It'll take you straight there to the Amazon book. You can order that book if you've ever wanted to calm your mind and kind of get some breathing in and also to kind of rejuvenate your body. And like you said, you know, get a better health and, and better everything, you know, and memory and all that stuff. I suggest you get this book because let me tell you something, yoga is a beautiful way to begin a journey that is a lifelong thing. Nguyen, thank you so much for being on the show. Thank you, thank you. And then thank well, you. this thing here, you, you take control of your body as well, so that's mm -hmm. very good. Oh yeah, oh yeah, definitely, I agree, I agree. We all have all that information for Nguyen's book in the description box. Please click on it and go straight there and purchase that book. Support, 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 guys. I want to thank you so much for being on the show, Nguyen. And thank you guys so much for tuning in to Dream Chasers Radio. And until next time, don't forget to what? Dare to be different. You've reached the end of another episode of the Global Summit House podcast. Subscribe to our podcast on Spotify, Podbean, iHeartRadio, iTunes, or Google Play. Connect with us at GlobalSummitHouse.com. See you on the next episode.